Arizona offers some amazing mule deer hunting. In the higher elevations in the early season, the biggest bucks are normally found north of the Grand Canyon. This is draw tag only country, with only the luckiest and the highest point holders getting a chance to hunt these units. Tag numbers should be on the upswing with the recent burn and the increased moisture we've received on the plateau. South of the Grand Canyon, Unit 1 was off last year and it could have been due to the coldest spring on record. Browse in the high country wasn't as good as it has been. Arizona Game and Fish is currently conducting a study in Unit 1 trying to figure out the migration patterns in and out of the unit. Unit 27 performed better if you got off the beaten path. Southeast Arizona in general received some of the lowest moisture amounts last year which affected the deer hunting in Unit 30, 29, 28. In those higher elevations, the coos deer are doing very well in Unit 34A. The lower country, where the mule deer live, suffered from the lack of rain. Winter storms in February have given that area some relief from the drought. We had a couple good years in the desert areas, and there was good fawn recruitment. And last year seemed to be a step back because of those dry conditions. Hopefully the majority of the mule deer will carry their fawns to term. Southern Arizona still offers the best opportunity for rifle hunters in Arizona with those early season tags. Have great draw odds in all the border units. On our website, we have a scouting channel, five bucks a month, and we guide you through where to hunt and how to stay safe. There are some great opportunities for hunting deer in the central part of the state. However, it is tougher to draw limited entry tags because they offer the opportunity for hunters to day hunt from home. In Arizona, sometimes the desert units surprise people the most with the huge deer that come out of there. It's due to the low density of deer. The southern rim of the Grand Canyon offers some amazing hunting and it hunts a little bit like the desert in that the deer densities are lower. The most difficult part of hunting those units is actually finding the deer in most cases. 